I don't I don't really know how I'm supposed to feel about this. I mean, on one end, yes, congratulations, Sarah Fuller. Absolutely, congratulations. You have become the first female Power 5 football player ever. That is an accomplishment to be taken note of. That is something that we should all look at and say, hey, that's... That's that's news. That's 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 a headline right there. That's that's a that's a front page headline. Sure. Sure. But as a football player, I'm confused. I'm confused. Let's let's just let's take a look. Let's take a look, shall we? Let's just take a look at this. Now, I don't get it. I don't get it. This is the opening kickoff. This is the first opportunity for this young lady to exhibit her skill set as a kicker. And let's not take anything away from Sarah Fuller. She is an SEC championship uh, soccer player on the women's women's team for Vanderbilt. She won the SEC championship off of her leg. She is an athlete. She has skills. She has kicking skills for real, for real. I just don't understand what the fuck that was. And I'm not even going to put it on her because if I'm thinking about it, and I've thought about this for about two hours before I decided to make a video about it. As much as I could easily use, she sucks, she can't kick as an excuse and say, oh, look at this terrible kick. It looks like dog shit. They recovered at their own 35. So Missouri actually wins by her kicking the ball like that. So if they plan to kick it like that, then it was just a shitty idea to begin with. But I don't really want to go there with it because I think she has the skill to kick this ball a little bit further than where the fuck she kicked it. I do believe that. I believe that these amateur coaches for Vanderbilt decided let's have her squib kick it to a return man to get the ball. It's to keep that team inside of their 20 yard line because an up man has to attempt to catch the ball or catch it off the bounce, which is a very hard thing to do in football. It's a very hard thing to do in football. And how different kickoffs actually look when you when they come off the foot, uh, they're gonna be like, that's a piece of shit kick. Why is she out there as the first kicker, first female kicker ever, if she's gonna kick some garbage? I'd rather have one that kicks a good kick. Now, again, don't get it, don't get me wrong here. I'm not saying that she can't kick. I believe she can. I'm saying that if that is the kick that they asked her to do, then they're assholes for asking her to do it. I would rather her boom it down the field and they return it for a touchdown and show that she was fully participating in a fully active football play the entire time of the play and be proud of that moment because even if she is, even if she does end up being in danger's way of being hit or being blocked or being run over by a ball carrier, she's in the game. She's playing football. And that, to me, is a big deal. That's a big deal. Don't protect her to, to a level that is unnecessary because I tell you what, that right there, that ball being kicked and her picking that up and, and, and Missouri picking that up at the you know, 35, 36 yard line, that's as good as her kicking it out of bounds, which is a penalty. That's as good as her kicking it out of bounds. Five more yards, five more yards, and that's at the 40 yard line, and she might as well have just shanked it off her leg into the fucking first row. That's, I mean, I don't understand. This is a moment that they set up for, it, it seems staged in that, and I hate to say that because I really feel like 
this is this should have been a much bigger moment. I've been waiting to kind of see what was going to happen with this in the past few days because it's been popping up on my radar, on my timelines, and I've been interested. I'm like, okay, cool. I would like to see a, a female kicker. I think that's actually a cool thing to have in the game. If she can kick it, then hell yeah, I'm all for it. But this is just... This is this is this this almost feels more pandering than it is actually giving her the credit that she's due as an athlete on the field, on the gridiron with other men. Let her be let her be immersed in it 100 percent without any kind of manipulation from from outside of the of those white lines, because that's that's what the game is all about. And I think that she would have an amazing appreciation of. For that, even if she had gotten ran over by somebody, she would have an appreciation for, hey, I was out there with the big boys on D1, on a Division One Power Five Conference football team. I kick off the balls for this team. And if I got to tackle somebody, then I'll make a tackle. If I get run over, I get run over. But I'm out here playing football. <sighs> So for me, that's it's disappointing that they, to me, and, and I'm not, and again, again, I am not taking anything away from the achievement of the moment, but from a football perspective, from a football perspective, somebody who is, who is, who lived in that life, who's been in that world my entire life, I feel like you, you, you know, there was a few seconds before this clip that popped up where she was absolutely uh, nervous, and you could tell your her knees kind of shook in a little bit. I mean, I, I I don't I'm not mad at her for that. I I mean anybody who's in that position is is gonna be nervous. Anybody who's on the field for the first time, hell, even before the game for veterans. The fragile patriarchy is losing their minds over this. You go, girl. My girls are watching. Uh, yeah. I mean, that's it's it's great encouragement for females in in sports. Sure. I mean, I'm I'm all for that. I mean. I got two daughters. I want them to go out there and ball out as well. Uh, you know, again, it's not about her being a kicker, uh, being a college football player now. It's not not about that. It's not. I think everybody can appreciate the achievement in that. I would hope. I just think that it's really uh, more about why didn't they like allow her to exhibit. You know, talent, exhibit your talent. Like they should have been practicing on this for a while now, I would think. Uh, that ball isn't much heavier than a soccer ball. So why didn't they allow her to just, you know, from from her level of talent, show us what she can do? That's that's where I just, I, that's where I don't get it. That's where I don't understand it. But let me know what you guys think. Leave your comments down below. Sarah Fuller, she is now the first woman in the Power Five football conferences uh, to play college football. She was kicker for Vanderbilt today in their game against Mizzou. Leave your comments down below. Hit that like button and subscribe to the Observant Lineman Uche Waneri. Appreciate you guys very much for checking out this video and I will catch you all on the next one. Peace.